is time to unveil some of the finest rock ever cooked in Santa Rosa County. Yep, the turkey roaster has been torched. There's the goodies. Notice how it's all level with sand. It's been off for ooh, how long has it been off? For a good while. A long time. It's still hotter than a firecracker. I don't think I'm gonna be able to get that stuff out of the bottom because it's hot. We're still on top. All right, let's see here. Piece of coastal plains. That's gonna be a sweet son of a gun right there. Mm. And that's a piece of real rough stuff. I cooked it before to 450, and I don't know how long I left it, but I just felt it looked like it needed to have some more. That's some rough, 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 rough stuff there from Gainesville, but it makes real authentic looking pieces. So. That's what I like about this kind of stuff. A lot of people won't work it. Old site material. Even got a fossil. piece of Burlington I just had laying around I figured I needed to cook it too <laughs> I cook it all I don't I don't I'm not I don't discriminate I just stick it all in there and cook it all up and what comes out comes out this is, this is the part where you gotta be really careful because you will find a, a sharp edge I try to grind them all down before I stick them in here It's a piece of Flint River stuff. It's a more of a the the more opaque type, but it's uh it's really really awesome. That's gonna be a nice piece. I pack it along the edges over here. All my little stuff around the outside edges. Bigger stuff I kind of stick in the middle. That's a big old piece of real tough coastal plains there but uh, I found that just a little bit of heat to it helps it out a lot it still is kind of raw but it makes awesome paleos it's a hot rock piece of coastal plains it's dark maroon There's a piece of that Texas Tough, big small flake I took off. Put it on the edge where it gets real hot. I know it's real thin, it can take the heat. That's a piece of sight material. That's going to be a killer point right there. It even looks good. Of course, that one there's got a crack from previous, so I don't know if it'll ever work or not. But you don't know till you heat it. Heat it up, and maybe it'll come out. Another piece of Burlington. What's packed in there tight? Coastal Plains. This is the real grainy stuff. You try to get the darker material to cook because it always comes out better. But I think that's going to do pretty good. Nothing else I'll give it to somebody I don't like. A 
It's a piece of coral. I've cooked it about eight times. I don't never think it's going to work. At 450, I could find to carry it to 6,000 degrees or something. Throw it at something. Make a hammer stone. There's a piece of coastal plains. Real big piece. It's big as my hand. I'm hoping I can make a real nice Morse knife or something nice out of that piece. I've got all the the good rock up here on this last inch. This is all crudy rudy over here. But all this nice dark brown is the better rock. Ooh, there's a piece of killer Flint River. It's been heated. It ought to be really nice. Old piece of keel cut. I just stuck it in there to heat it. I know it ain't enough heat, but I work them raw, so that bothers me too bad. One thing that bothers me now is my joints. My knee joints, my hip joints. Oh. Alright. Ooh, piece of pinhead coral. Make you want to slap your mama right there. Another piece of pinhead coral. An old chunky piece, but it'll work, I promise you. There's a killer in there. Uh oh. Got a little hot. Had it right up against the edge. So that means it's real fragile from now on. Another piece of Texas Tough. Piece of Texas Tough I got from Butch. Still sounds good. Coastal Plains. That stuff was like clear when I put it in there, so it turned kind of red. I bet that's going to be sweet. Texas Tough. Piece of coral. Got some honeycomb in it. Pot lid. Texas tough. Well, there ain't one piece left. And that's the big beast. It's a hand to shoulder. I mean, hand to a Arm, armpit there, elbow. Can't get my anatomy right this morning. Thank you. 